Hey, I'm Jim from Sp No, I'm not there anymore. I'm Jim Jansen, and I recently joined Crescent Parts and Equipment back in July of this year. I'm a refrigeration territory manager, and today we're gonna talk about A2O refrigerants and some things you ought to know. We're gonna get right into those things. First, an A2L behaves in the system pretty much like an A1 refrigerant would. And if you do happen to have a leak, don't vent the charge. You go about fixing the leak just like you normally would. And you use a compatible, dedicated recovery machine that is A2L rated. And we're gonna get into that in a future video. A2L refrigerants do not, I'll repeat that, do not contain R290 as a constituent. And because of that, they're a little harder to ignite than what you might think. But if you do manage to ignite an A2L refrigerant, they won't burn very energetically. Uh, and they are for use in new, designed for A2L systems only. And because of that, do not retrofit an A1 system to any flammable refrigerant. And if somebody tries to talk into that, don't walk away, run. Thanks for watching. Click subscribe and we'll see you next time.